Today I'm going to show my large pulse motor first test run. It's been a while because it was dismantled. Now I have put it back together again. And as you can see, it's a pretty large one. I put it back together so I can do the uh, high speed, high RPM test for all my uh, own design generator coils. The generator will come over here at this spot. Pulleys, everything is made of wood. Pulleys, belts. This is a large flywheel. It's for iron. Yeah, you can hear. It's a pretty heavy one. It's around, I think, 20 kilos. Here I have the panel, the meters panel, or the switching panel, whatever. One amp meter, three amp meter, digital volt meter, analog mode volt meter, and all the switches. On this pulse motor, I have also a DC to DC converter. That is because I don't have a power supply. This side you can see the, the motor part itself. There's a flywheel over here. You can see that. The circuitry is uh, on the, in this box. The circuitry is kind of the same as my previous uh, videos. It is uh, comprised of um, Angelo MOSFET, small general uh, NPN transistor, a transformer, caps and so on. Gives me the ability uh, to have a 3 speed circuitry to start up. Okay, gonna switch it on. Gonna drive it on 18 volts input. A little spin. First speed. It is uh, pulls around 1 amp now. You can hear it going and see it going. Going on for second speed. I'm trying to get a full view of this thing, this boost motor. It's a small laboratory here. Yeah, I think this is about right. It's a perfect spot here. Going for a third speed and overdrive. Yeah, you can hear them. That's about the, that's a complete unit. Gonna go over from this meter here to this one. It is drawing now just below 400 milliamps. I think it will settle around 300 milliamps at 18 volt input and this pulley here is doing around 1800 rpm and with that and this belt here connected to the pulley of the generator comes over here I can reach anything from 2000 till 3000 and even more depending on my needs but I don't like to go over 3000 rpm You can see the large flywheel spinning. Yeah, 
Yeah, the draw is now 275, 260 milliamps at 18 volts input. One more time, a complete view. Yeah, there it is. It is large, but it's running pretty smooth. Nice and smooth. After this video, I will start with the high speed generator coil testing of my own design. Gonna shut the system down. As you can see now, there's absolutely no input. But because of this large and heavy flywheel, it will keep spinning for minutes and minutes so uh, I'm gonna end this video shortly one more time from this side and one more time from this side thanks for watching